viewers welcome to my channel in the previous videos we discussed about uh, what are the interviruses uh, what are the symptoms and signs of virus infections and the risk factors uh, but in today's video i will focus on the diagnosis and uh, explain how your physician or your doctor or your family doctor will uh, diagnose uh, the interviral infection. Now, interviral infections are most often diagnosed by the clinical symptoms. Blood tests uh, are not required most of the time, you know. And the best test is uh, uh, polymerase chain reaction, which is also known as PCR test, you know. And uh, which is uh, available from the specialized laboratories only, you know, and used most often during outbreaks of the viral infections. And it's uh, not commonly used. And uh, it's useful to distinguish between the entire virus infections and other viral infections like uh, uh, rotaviruses and uh, in, uh, influenza viruses, you know. And uh, the infecting entire virus will be isolated by cell cultures taken from the blood, you know feces and the cerebrospinal fluid and then identified by further immunology tests you know and other tests like uh, chest x-rays echocardiography lumbar puncture test and uh, ecgs uh, may be helpful to determine uh, the extent of the infection you know uh, so there was uh, about how your physician will uh, diagnose the entire virus infection and how will you know what type of uh, virus is causing uh, these symptoms or this problem you know keep watching and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day in the next video i will explain the treatment options once someone is diagnosed with the entire virus you know keep watching goodbye